Yo, I'm still recovering after that first episode. Hey guys, what's good? How are we doing today? Welcome back to the channel. All right, so in our last reaction of Oshinoko, we reacted to episode one. Took me and what seems like the entire rest of the world by surprise. Like who thought a first episode of an anime could be that good? But after watching the first episode, we realized it's just the prologue. Ai is not the main character. We're going to be following her two children while they, I think they're in high school, right? Aqua and Ruby. I'm pretty sure the show is still gonna stay in the entertainment industry. Like maybe Aqua is gonna become an actor, Ruby. I'm pretty sure they foreshadowed her becoming an idol. But the main plot, it seems like, is going to be Aqua trying to track down exactly who set Ai up to be killed. At the end of the episode, he thinks it might be his father, but we don't know for sure. So I'm super pumped to see where this story is going to go. All right, guys. So before we get to today's reaction, if you want to show me some support, be sure to hit that like button if you have not done so yet. Smash that subscribe button. Hit the bell for notifications. Friendly reminder, I will be streaming these reactions over on Twitch. So if you want to get a head start on that, go over there. Hit the follow button. The link should be down in the description below. All right, guys. So with all that out of the way, Let's get it. I would like to be an idol, yes. 136,000 applicants. She's probably going to have some tough competition. Been waiting two years for this audition. Uh, I hope she gets it, even though I feel like she won't. Mm, she wants to follow I, her mom. Makes sense, though. Two secrets. What are they? So, okay, they're still keeping that their mother is I a secret. Mm. So she still isn't. Has she not told Aqua who she is yet either? Dude, that sucks seeing her in that condition. Children that go through that kind of medical trauma, I just. It's hard not to feel bad. <laughs> it's weird hearing his deeper voice. I got so used to hearing his younger voice. Mm, don't have illusions. Salary is low. Yeah, we saw how much I was struggling in the prologue with, with her salary and that stuff. Yeah, let him know, Ruby. You had a terrible past life. Might as well try and live it up now. Oh, the director's place. That's right. The director raised him, right? I wish Aqua and Ruby told each other who they were in the past. Oh, dang. He's been up to something ever since. <laughs> so he's not even telling her he's trying to figure out who killed I. Wait. Ichigo san fell out of contact. Ichigo san is the director, right? After the incident. After which Miyako took over the agencies. Miyako, the hot waifu? Okay, they're managing internet personalities. All right, so waifu's still in the picture. The director just dipped. Having essentially won the lottery. <laughs> Damn, man. The whole, like, future without I just seems so gloomy. Oh, audition's calling her. What was with that look in her eye? Oh, she's saying I see. Oh, she didn't make it, did she? Oh, damn. Why do they have to go so hard with the teary-eyed faces? That's reality. Dang, man. This this show really calls out how harsh the entertainment industry is. Yo, the director's apartment looks like a vibe. You can fool your own twin sister? Gets a call from them for real. Wait, I already... S Whoa, wait, what? I already sent them a short text from Ruby's phone saying she was withdrawing. Crush your sister's dreams. He doesn't want his sister to become an idol? Dude, his eye. Oh man, he doesn't want her to become an idol so she doesn't end up the same as I. Dude, Aqua is dark as hell now, man. He's, he's emo. Oh, 
<laughs> Underground idol groups. Aqua's not gonna like that. She looks like she really wants to be an idol. Aqua, just let her do it. He just won't let it go, bro. So I like how they turned this wife's character into from like this scheming, like angry woman having to take care of these babies to now she actually legitimately is being like a good parent figure to them and cares deeply. I love that. Yeah, she's even saying she has the qualities to become an idol. It's gonna happen eventually. Look at him! Oh wait, he's acting like he's an agent for Bikomachi. What is he doing? <laughs> Dude, her face! Mm, so he is he just trying to figure out if this group is good or not for her? A better deal? Oh, he wants to know the term she's working under. Based on the number of photos with fans. Dude, there's so much work into being an idol. Damn, most months doesn't even take home 100,000 yen. That's rough. Favoritism. The two of them are dating? That is a little suspect. <laughs> mm, scouting for new members like crazy. Uh, I feel bad though. They're getting this girl's hopes up thinking they're actually scouting her, but they're not. Yep, he's about a cock block Ruby. This dude, Aqua is so dark now. He's so serious. Oh, hiring her for real. Oh shit, not gonna hire someone who badmouths their colleagues, get wrecked. <laughs> Calling victim to stalking. Dude. <laughs> How is, is she actually going to an audition? I thought Aqua was not gonna even let her go somewhere. I'm gonna become like mom. Damn, she's starting to cry. Oh, join our agency. They're gonna make... Oh, she made the decision to bring back idols. I wonder if Aka was okay with this, though. Look how happy she looks looking at it. It's so cute. What do you mean, never said I was against it? You, that's what you've been saying all episode. Who is this purple haired lady? Why is she living with the director? Is she his wife? Oh, he's a middle schooler. <laughs> they drew this middle schooler to look like a high schooler. Wait, and I'm just realizing so a middle schooler went up and scouted that girl on the streets? How did she not realize that he was a middle schooler? <laughs> Okay, so he is okay with it because it's Strawberry doing it. Dang, so he doesn't even want to be an actor anymore. I thought he was going to be a star actor. A mere means to an end. Aw, oh, man. Why are they showing us that image of Ai again, dude? Giving him a taste of the pain. I wonder if he's even seen the father yet. Okay, so being an actor, he doesn't even care. He just needs to be in the entertainment industry to find his dad. Yeah, it seems like he has no dreams or ambitions. He just is solely focused on finding his dad. Facts. <laughs> Who is this woman? Oh, it's his mom. <laughs> okay. I was like, no way he's married to her. <laughs> the mom interrupting him. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. You're mid-40s. 
<laughs> He's still living at his parents' house in his mid 40s. Does he not make money from his movies? True, you're you're better than her in certain ways. Mm. The director's saying some good shit to him though, I will say that. Bro, why are they having the mom interrupt? I was so interested in what he was about to say. Yoto High School. Integrated Middle and High School. I, oh, wait. Said something else. Integrated Middle and High School and one of the few in Japan that has a performing arts department. <laughs> Quite the name you've got there. <laughs> My name is to blame. Come on, Aquamarine's a lit name. Oh shit! That's the the, the child actor from the first episode. Look at her eyes. I did not realize she had galaxy eyes too. Damn, he doesn't remember her. But Ruby does. <laughs> what is this? Bacon soda? What was that <laughs> freaking image they just showed us? Called it quits. <laughs> Yo, does she have a thing for Aqua? Nandayo! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's the end? Don't tell me that's the end. Oh no, man. She was expecting him to be in the performing arts, but he's not. I feel like he will end up transferring. If he doesn't, I'll be shocked. Well, that's lit. Her character's coming back. All right, so that was episode two of Oshi Noko, and I am glad to say that episode two is still just as good as the first episode. So it seems like we're picking up with Aqua and Ruby when they're just going into high school, and I was right. Ruby wants to be an idol. I thought Aqua was going to want to be or already be like an established actor, but it seems like he dropped it because he's just so focused on his goal to get revenge on I dying. But I will say, especially after they reintroduced the redhead girl at the end of this episode i feel like he he might get back into acting or at least she'll like kind of be the catalyst to push him into getting back into acting i'll be shocked if he doesn't do any acting in for the rest of the show man i gotta say this whole episode even though there was no death or anything it just had this really gloomy overtone with it like you still just feel the impact of eyes death in every single character there wasn't really there was a, a, a little bit of comedic relief but honestly, it, it still seems pretty dark. Now, my main question is like, what's obviously the main overarching plot is going to be Aqua trying to find the dad or at least whoever is responsible for I dying. But is that going to be like half and half focused with like Ruby being an idol, Aqua acting, or is like the dad stuff always going to be like the forefront of the plot? I'm not sure. I don't know how long the manga has gone for, or if the manga is even over yet. Um, but I'm definitely interested to see like where the main focus of the show is going to be. But I really just like how realistic this show feels. The the way the characters talk, the, like the emotions, them calling out like the entertainment industry. Like there's no fluff in this show. It all feels really realistic, and and it, it's definitely one of the shiners in this spring anime season. Like I'll be shocked if this isn't in contention for anime of the year all right guys so remember if you enjoyed today's reaction hit that like button if you have not done so yet smash that subscribe button hit the bell for notification i hope you guys have a great rest of your day remember stay blessed not stressed out there hope to see you in the next one peace